All right, let's get a little more stuff. All right, now open this door because Barry's an idiot. Oh, well, this way. What? How do I get over there? <laughs> Is that you over there, Barry? Could have just come with me. Ah, uh, Al? I had you to find out there, a key buddy? to get oh, me out. Yeah, it's me. Hang on. I'll try to find a key to get the door open. Yeah, it's gotta be somewhere here. Wait, I just thought I saw something. Hey, watch the hold up. Come on, this place is all. You know what? You could have just come with me, and you'd be out, and I wouldn't have to come back for you, but. Barry wanted to check out the stuff. That is a big lock. Come on, Al, open the door already. See hey, let's go, yeah. man. Now you want to go? Oh, whoops. I think we're gonna have to work together to open this gate, Al. Looks pretty heavy. Ah! <laughs> Hey, I think that's the farm on the other side of the field. We're almost there. This farm is a crazy place for crazy people. We should feel right at home then. Yep. All right, here we are. Come on, one more gate. Let's do yeah. this. Yeah. <laughs> All right, Barry, nice job. You've earned your keep. Just where's my cutout? Lights are out. I guess we better check the fuse box. There's a fuse box? Where? Right, let's check it out. Oh, what the snap is this? Oh, it looked like arrows. Nice. The power downstairs was out, but I was sure I could fix that at the fuse Where's box. Where's the fuse box? Is it outside? No, I don't know where these guys keep their fuse box. Oh, it does give me the little the HUD. You know, this place looks kind of lived in. I thought the Andersons were on the booby hatch. Yeah, I don't think they keep too close an eye on them at the clinic. They seem to slip away a lot so they can get wasted. No kidding! Those guys sound awesome. Fix the record. Can you hear that, this? Al? Music? Of course. We need All to find where it's coming from. That's the message the Andersons talked about. That's the whole reason we're here. Lady of the Light? Oh, that's gotta be... What's her face? The crazy lamp lady from the oh. town. Cynthia Weaver. Right! Must be! Okay. Yep, we, we were given that. I've seen her. Okay. We need to find Cynthia Weaver. We'll stay here for the night yeah, and head that back sounds to town safe. as soon as it gets light. Hey, Al. Lots of hours before dawn. Might as well get some rest. And by rest, I mean drunk. Come on, Barry. This is... Yeah. What the hell? Yeah, you know, there's just people that want to kill us outside. We might as well get wasted. I'm gonna stick by you, no matter what, ever, Al. Sure, like a brother. I'm a writer, goddammit. You are wasted. If I just wanted to, I could write ten books a year. And and they'd be the best books that year. No, you couldn't. That's right, I couldn't. But I could, because I'm a writer. What? What do they put in this stuff? I feel like my brain is coming out of my nose. <laughs> 
I'm gonna get the recipe off those coots and be a, a, a booze millionaire. I just miss her, Barry. I just want her here with me. I know, Al. I know. It's gonna be okay. Yeah, it's gonna be okay, We're Barry. Gonna make it okay. Us drunks gotta stick together. Alrighty. <laughs> I don't know why you'd waste any time. Why not just, you know, like, well, I guess you'd want to wait till. Oh, shit. I guess that'd kind of scare me if a cutout was watching me sleep. I'm Alan Wake. Oh, snap. Oh. Oh, snap, we're here. We're on Diver's Isle. Oh, but we're like a ghost. Alan! Oh, I remember this. Where are you? Help! Alice, I'm coming. It's all right. I'm coming. No! It was a crazy Alan! drunken dream. Help and yet, me! it was more than that. It was the truth. A suppressed memory unearthed by Find the out what happened shot. to you. Oh, I was snap. there, an out-of-body observer. This was the night Alice and I had arrived at Bright Falls, the night Alice had disappeared. Oh, crazy. I had a chance to find out what had happened. I remembered being surprised to see the cabin dark. Alice would Alice? never turn the Alice. lights off. Oh, crazy. Dude, I would show a little more. Oh, that's right. I remembered thinking... I caught a glimpse of her form underwater, sinking into the darkness. <gasps> the Russian Diving Dutch gives it a was ten. the last vague memory I had of that night. After that, the next thing I could remember was waking up behind right. the wheel of the crash car and finding the first pages of the manuscript. <gasps> I couldn't find her in all that blackness. Oh, no. I must have thought she drowned. <coughs> Alice! Jagger had Alice. Alice. And so she had me. Alice! <coughs> I'd been easy prey. Look at the cabin. Is there someone in the window? What? Alice? Maybe she didn't drown after all. Maybe she's inside. Alice! Yes. Crazy the lady. Had touched me. She had dug her nails into my brain and used me. Made me her puppet. Oh, I guess I could have come down here to watch. She must be here somewhere. Maybe upstairs in the study. Alice! Yes, that's where she is. You can apologize. Kill you. Alice! You'll laugh at the whole thing together and put it behind you. Alice! She's not here. You were foolish to think so. No, she's dead. She drowned. No, no, no! It's your fault your wife is dead. You are guilty. All she wanted was to help you right. You killed her. Ah! Oh, hush. There's still hope. Cauldron Lake is a special you place. Crazy lady. Here, you have the power to change things. What do I have she to do? She wanted you to write. I will tell you what to do. Don't do it. You can write her back. The story will come true, and all will be well again. Better be. She had Alice, and the manuscript was the ransom for her. That's crazy. Uh. Yes. I'll write. I'll fix it. I'll bring her back. That's creepy. Oh, Jesus. No. I wrote it. I remembered it all now. 
In the dark, I'd written for days, a week, almost a complete manuscript of a novel entitled Departure. Jagger had been my editor, whispering in my ear, making sure that the unfolding story would make her more and more powerful. I thought I was saving Alice. Way to go, Wake. Even with the cobweb she put in my head, some part of me had been aware enough to write my escape into nice. a story. To bring a light into the cabin to release me before I could finish. To interrupt the horror story before the ending, where darkness consumed everything and everyone. Yeah. Zane was weak and far away, but I had written him into the story and his light had been enough to set me free. It is here now. I'm here because it was written. I brought the light to set you free. You must hurry. You will know I'm here. It will be Whoa, soon. cool. She stole the skin of my barber a long time ago. She looks so old. Oh, crap. Looks like something from Bioshock. Up, confused and groggy. My mind consumed by darkness and fear. All I could do was to escape. The week spent in the cabin had taken its toll. Oh, okay, this is where he gets in the car. And fading fast. It had to have cost Zane terribly, thrown him even deeper into whatever dark place he now haunted. But he had managed to weaken the dark presence, kept me safe that night. How safe? Not very. Oh, crap. That's crazy. The story's all coming together. I wrote it. It's my fault. That's right, James Joyce. It's your Who fault. Is this? You're gonna pay Night for kill? it. Oh, snap. Woo. Well... That is episode four, The Truth, and now we do know. We know some of the truth. This has been a pretty crazy episode for me. Uh, pretty frustrating. I died quite way too many times, but I hope you still enjoyed it, and I uh, hope you'll keep watching. Uh, I know I'm going to keep playing soon, so. My name is Focal Fury, Dan, and you've been watching Alan Wake. Take it easy, everybody.